Son of a bear moving forward. They're all in line and ready for the start. And they're off. And toward the outside, there goes Regal Company. And from between horses, it's Taylor's Flight. Passing the stands for the first time, Taylor's Flight has the lead. Regal Company on the outside. King Jordan down at the rail saves ground in third position. Rummy's Command with the orange cap moves through between horses fourth. Son of a Bear on the outside is fifth and moving up a bit, followed by Rutledge Lion. They swing around the turn and race to the back stretch, and it is Taylor's Flight. With the white blinkers showing the way by a, a, three parts of a length now. Regal Command is in second position. Son of a Bear on the outside is third by a length. King Jordan at the fence is fourth at this point, about two and a half from the lead. And then comes King Jordan followed by Rummy's Command. After that, it's a Clark County and a gap of two lengths to Rutledge Lion. And at the back of the pack, Tough Talkin' is the trailer. They're midway on the turn. And it is still Taylor's Flight who holds on to the lead doggedly by three parts of a length. And on the outside, Regal Company tries to close the gap as they move to the top of the stretch. Son of a Bear is racing third along the inside. Cuts the corner well. They're in the lane and turning for home. It is uh, Taylor's Flight with Rodney Sudin holding on to the lead by a length and a quarter. On the extreme outside, here comes Green Spring Boy. But too late. Taylor's Flight wins it. Green Spring Boy finishes second. Son of a Bear third in the West Virginia Lottery Breeders' Classic.